Disclaimer. Warning. This video is a video about Ishan, BJYX. This video is only made for BJYX or ZSWW fans. If you don't like it, please don't watch it. If you are not Ishan Shiper, please don't watch it. If you're still watching it, I assume that you believe it. And if you are a new turtle, welcome to our family. All I'm going to tell you is CPN. 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 Accept it calmly and make good comments. It is strictly forbidden to comment harshly and vilify other artists. All sources in this video have been uploaded by other fans on their social media. I just collected and edited it to make it easier to understand. I put the account that I usually use as a source in the description column. Remember, all I'm telling you is CPN. Think wisely and with common sense in accepting it. Hey Chaser here. Have you seen some of the videos of Gigi who was in Milan yesterday? Today's video is a video of Gigi's departure to Milan yesterday. Well, let's see the video. Before I explain, I said many times that I translated this video using Google Translate. So there are definitely some words that are not appropriate. I will explain as best as I can and to the best of my understanding of the video that I got. I got this video on February 22, 2024. And I edited it the day after. There are three videos. If you've seen the video footage of Gigi leaving for Milan and can't bear to watch it again, you can skip that part. Some of you may have seen this video. Actually, I was a little hesitant to share this video with you. Like a dilemma. Because this video was taken by someone who was at the location. Like supporting these people to do the same thing again. But however you have to know that crazy Chinese fans were really scary I think. It's no surprise that their idol reported it. And Gigi must be more protected from this kind of people. This is a video of Gigi going to Milan for Gucci and Todd's Fashion Week 2024. This year Gigi departed from Shanghai Airport instead of Beijing. With a very busy and rushed schedule, Gigi doesn't even dress like usual. What surprised me was Gigi who was angry and raised his voice. He says, Don't you understand what I'm saying? Move forward. In fact, a few days ago, Xiao Zhan's studio gave an ultimatum. The essence of the issue is that Gigi will only meet its fans at official events. And fans are not allowed to gather in front of the hotel or at the shooting location even drop him off or pick him up at the airport because it can disturb public order and other people some time ago before xd studio posted that statement actually the official weibo of gg's latest drama had posted a statement that it was not allowed to take pictures or videos from gg's latest drama because it is still a confidential but some fans still do the same thing they take photos illegally and even distribute them they gave that statement twice, as far as I remember. And finally Xiao Zhan Studio posted the statement. I share with you some of the stories. This post also made me hesitate to share this CPN. On October 19, 24, someone violated the airport order and broke through, causing all passengers on the flight including Xiao Xiao, to be blocked from boarding and the flight was delayed. As a result, just because Xiao Xiao was on the same flight, there were various rumors that he was late or that the flight was delayed due to his fans. Xiao Xiao, who was always most afraid of trouble others, immediately stood up and apologized. In fact, he was also troubled by those fans. The airport was besieged on December 7, 2019. He moved with difficulty in the water-blocked area and even reminded him to go back in a gentle voice. However, his peacefulness and gentleness only provoked intensification and unscrupulousness, and it was difficult to distinguish between them in the chaos. A group of people
people with different attributes held up cameras and mobile phones to yell at his face, showing no trace of the minimum politeness and propriety that should be maintained between people. He lowered his head and finally said helplessly, that's okay, and was finally pushed forward by the security guard, staggering a few times. If you have done some archaeology, you have also seen those pictures of beautiful Japanese boys at the airport. You have seen that at the beginning when not so many people knew him, he had no assistants or bodyguards, and he had to carry his own luggage at the airport. In the end, there were too too many on his hands, so he could only bite the ticket with his mouth. At that time, there were very few fans picking him up at the airport. He would chat with them, smile at them, walk with them for a while, speak gentle words, and laugh without warning. In those cabins, the bastards were sitting next to their seats, staring and following them horrifyingly. Those photos were taken under such circumstances, and they were voyeuristic without respect. In 2020, he had always tolerated everything. In 2021, the code lock on the hotel floor was maliciously destroyed. He had no retreat and no place to hide. He faced the door with his head lowered, and there was a circle behind him to film his illegitimate life. The flash flash and the shutter sound were locked in a stalemate, with no distance at all, for who knows how long. You don't understand how helpless and desolate he felt at that time, whether it was those moments when he said he was tired and regretted joining the entertainment industry, those moments when he couldn't figure it out. In 2022, the stealth has been reached to the extreme, and the whereabouts at the airport are extremely hidden. It seems that the biggest illegitimate incident revealed is that someone was maliciously stopped and jammed when leaving the warehouse in the parking lot. But in fact, it is far more than that. Those who squat on their way to and from work there was never a shortage of agents and other types of people, and from time to time someone who was out of control would rush towards him, but he would not calm down. On February 22, 2023, it was the first international airport after three years of full opening and recovery. There was no VIP channel. He had already foreseen a certain situation and chose to travel in the middle of the early morning. He thought that such a time would always be quieter, but he still encountered the problem. He was overwhelmed, and in desperation, he personally screamed to maintain order. A cautious person said so many words, and his tone no longer cared about protecting his voice. When others maliciously took pictures of his passport, he helplessly and alertly reached out to intercept and protect himself. Trouble. Don't take pictures of my personal information, thank you. On February 22, 2024, Gigi set out from Milan in the early morning. The day before, he had just appealed and asked not to be surrounded and squatted, and to respect others and respect myself. Still encountered pushing and crowding at the airport in the early morning. He also finally broke out in public for the first time in several years. What are you doing? Is there any order? Mud Bodhisattva finally couldn't bear it anymore. Actually, this really disrupted Gigi's schedule. And he was actually late. The flight originally scheduled for 1.45 a.m. was delayed to 3.05 a.m. Safe flight, safe flight. I really hope Gigi enjoys his trip while in Milan. And hope that overseas fans can keep their distance better when they encounter Gigi. We must protect his sun-like smile. The next CPN was like the previous year when Gigi went to Milan. Didi can't stay still. When Gigi went to Milan, Didi's EMO fashion playlist reappeared. You can see the playlist is like poetry. And at that time Beijing and Shanghai were cloudy. Doesn't the weather also support his mood? The last thing is to ask for his love. Isn't it talking about Gigi, busy work status? Didi was really lonely. Each one is telling, I feel so lonely without brother Jean by my side. Yesterday Gigi also carried a bag and web shoes specially customized for him by Gucci. This is also the first time Gigi has labeled a series of shoes. 
so it doesn't matter if Gigi and Didi are inseparable. Do you feel calmer wearing those web shoes? Because the web is like Didi's name. Next is the Gigi's suitcase which has a rabbit sticker attached to it. Very funny. For some reason he didn't use a suitcase before. This one. Or the one Gigi used last year. I discussed it in two GG videos at Milan 2023. Did Didi take him home to Beijing? I will discuss this in another video about Didi visiting during Chinese New Year 2024. Ah, or maybe in the previous suitcases there were still clothes left behind at the shooting location. Let's think positive. The next one is about fake story which I posted on the 22nd yesterday on Instagram. It's just an image. Without explaining it, you will definitely understand the meaning of the picture. But what's even funnier is that it turns out the fake story is related to SDC5. If you followed the video I uploaded previously you will definitely remember when Gigi was rumored to be visiting SDC5 and a dancer caught them kissing. There I said that Gigi kissed DD who was sleeping. But apparently there is another version. It wasn't Gigi who kissed DD but DD who kissed Gigi at that time. The incident occurred in the dressing room. And that is as depicted in the fake story which was released yesterday on February 21st, 2024. Two people sat on the sofa side by side. The red and the green. Their heads stuck together. It looked like they were kissing. But suddenly someone came in. The blue one. Then the red one pushed the green one quickly. Like nothing happened. Woman,我先走 这一声声压轴脾气的谢谢再对比今天我们等着肖战的包王一博的鞋子咱就说咋不用之前的那个行李箱了原本以为只有队友撞到后边进无理的调侃你们要给我作证
，我想推你啊，你推，你把我推推把那个推。所以大宝就是这么推来推去，把自己推到了仔仔怀里喽。That was video for today. See you in the next video. Thank you for watching.